Hi, and welcome to the beginner's guide of how to use your new favorite device, the Bear. This is Froyo's first venture into microcurrent technology, and it has some really unique features, mainly my favorite being that it's paired with T-Sonic pulsations, which is something that we know and love with the Lunar range. What you're gonna need for this facial, either your phone or your iPad or your computer, which has your Foreo For You app. You can get this from the Apple Store. You can also get this from the Play Store, wherever you get your apps from. Have your device ready. Make sure to have cleansed your skin entirely, removing all oils. So you want to use either a gel cleanser, but with no oils within it whatsoever. We're also gonna need a way for that power and energy from the microcurrent to get deep into the skin where we really want it, the muscles. So you will need a water-based serum. This can be anything, which is not usually what many brands say. However, we would suggest that you use the Serum Serum Serum, which is by Foreo. This is a personal favorite due to the fact that it's so high in hyaluronic acid serum. There's actually three forms within it. So this is great to use with the device. What I'm gonna be doing is having the screen uploaded here. So feel free to follow. I'm basically gonna be adding a bit of a human touch to our already great visuals. What you want to do is to go on your Foreo app. You don't even need to hold the device for five seconds to put it in pairing mode. The device will already know it's there. Click start. What this is gonna do is it's activating the little flashing indicator light which is based just here on your bare device. This is saying that it's ready. We click start treatment. Here you can decide if you would like the T-Sonic pulsations either on or off. Trust me, you want it on. Microcurrent here, you actually have five choices with the bear. That's what makes this so powerful. Each level is signified as five in the Foreo language. So 25 being the most powerful. That's what we're going for today. The benefit with this device is that it has the anti-shock system. This scans the skin and makes sure that you're getting the optimum level of microcurrent technology as deep into the skin, but without that shocking feel. Pretty shocking, right? So when you're ready, click start. So what the app is also gonna help you with is for registering the device uh, to communicate to custom services and also to find out any new protocols that are released in the future, which will happen. So now back to real life without the app. I also wanna showcase how you can use the bear without even needing the app at all after pairing it for the first time, remember that. But for this beginner's guide, what we're gonna focus on are just the key elements to a facial lifting massage. Obviously with the treatment, using T-Sonic pulsations and microcurrent and great movement, your skin will always look more sculpted. However, it can sometimes swell. This isn't an issue at all, you're massaging the skin. Just make sure that every single motion is outwards and up like I'm gonna be showing you. The most important thing is that you use this on fully, fully cleansed skin. This is a really great tip. I've already coated my skin in a layer of the Serum Serum Serum. It can be any water-based gel, but this one works best with the device. The reason why I actually coat a layer in the skin and let it sink in is because this device works best when your skin is as moisturized as possible. Also, the more moisture through the skin, it actually allows the channeling of the microcurrent to be even better and make it even more effective. So I have the full layer everywhere soaking in for the past few minutes. So this would be a great time to brush your teeth, send a voice note, whatever. You're then gonna section off your face in certain areas. So let's get ready. Click on the universal power button once. This is the indicator light. And by clicking it just once, I can activate different intensity settings. Double clicking it, I can actually turn the T-Sonic pulsations off. I doubt I would ever meet someone that would want to, but I'd rather just tell you just in case. Pumping a nice amount onto the skin. Remember, always slightly applying it under the jawline because you are gonna use this in this protocol. This is our beginner's guide and it's gonna be the much more simplistic but really effective facial. So getting the device, we start from the bottom to the top. All this is doing is it's basically hugging, like this, the contours of the jawline. I do five sweeps. Then I notch it a level up, just under the nasal fold, all the way up to the ear. It's gonna feel like you're going slightly under the cheekbone and you're just pushing everything up. This is also a great way of expelling any excess water retention and puffiness. This is my favorite. Then we notch it up one more level. This is going to be completely hugging the contours of the cheekbone. And we go right from the laughter line, nasal fold, all the way up to the temple.
So let's do four more motions here. If you do one extra, I lost count. That's okay. It's all gonna be effective. Why I zone the skin off is actually to make sure that the serum is gonna be as prominent on the skin as possible. I don't want it to absorb too much. Clicking it on once again. It has a really great timer, which makes sure that you'll never leave it on by accident. So with the forehead, this is where it gets really, really flexible. What I would do is apply the serum all over the forehead region, up to the hairline. If it's a day you're not gonna be showcasing that blow dry or you don't mind, really push the gel as far into the hairline as possible. This will just allow you comfortably to make sure you can lift as high as possible. So, coating the whole forehead area. I then basically just do upward motions around the whole area. So I section each brow into three upward motions and the middle inner brow as one together. I then go the same back. I like to keep the skin guessing, similar to a workout. My body was maybe thinking it would be starting here. Always keep a guessing. Motions can also be as slow or as fast as you want. We don't actually leave a, a specific time that you need to hold it or anything indicating that you have to take this long. The main benefit is the actual technology itself and the motion that you use it is really just depending on how long you want to spend doing your protocol. This took hardly any time at all. And now to include the neck and bring it up into my jawline, which is my top tip in terms of connecting this whole area with a microcurrent facial. The reason why I include this even in the beginner's one is we should always be starting to include this motion at whatever level we begin at. So clicking once on again, you will just do slow passes up to the jawline. We don't ever go above the throat. Really wanna focus on these two areas going up and lifting up to the cheek muscle. We will do five on this side can take your time if you want. And then doing the same motion, but lifting all the way to here, just under the cheekbone. It's really gonna help assist and lifting those muscles to really give you that contour chiseled look. We're now gonna carry on and speed the section up, just doing the same on the other left hand side. Thank you.